Uh, some of the challenges of running a business downtown right now are, I think, really just convincing people to come down here. Um, it's we have a lack of just uh, people on the streets. Um, um, people think that it's dangerous. People think that you know their safety is at risk, um, and and that's I think for us been the biggest challenge. Um, and then for a lot of other business owners and now ourselves. Um, experience uh, uh, vandalism, broken windows, break-ins, you know, theft. Um, there's a lot of people on the streets with addiction problems um, that, you know, uh, um, a lot of people don't feel comfortable with and, and I understand that, you know, it's hard to, to convince somebody that, you know, it, that downtown's a great place to be these days and, and I think according to a lot of our politicians, um, everything is on the upswing and, and we've been down here five years now and I feel like it's the opposite. I think things are worse than they've ever been and, and I'm someone who grew up in the area who uh, frequented downtown every single weekend for years and years and years and I've just seen it get worse and worse and worse and it's really, really hard to stay hopeful. Um, you know, that being said, I, I am still committed to this neighborhood for the time being and I want to see it flourish and grow. We need more people living down here. I think that's key. Um, I think we need more than just bars, like we, we need more retail. We need the things that, that keep coming up and keep being said, like we, we, we need more amenities and things to bring people down here. Um, and we're trying really hard, but when there's, even the bars are going away, like it's, uh, it's hard to convince someone to come down and spend a night on the town when there's only a few places that they want to go. And we've, we've seen that recently where we've had people come um, and perhaps say, you know, we're full at the time and they, they say, well, we're going to go to another neighborhood. We're going to take off because there's no, nowhere else that we want to we want to hang out and we've lost them for that evening as a customer. Okay, I'll put a positive spin on some of the things that have happened. Um, the response to what happened, the broken window, was very unexpected. Uh, the outpouring of love and support was was amazing, unexpected, touching, um, and uh, it shows that there are people out there that want to see downtown flourish, want to see it improve. Um, so yeah, like we're not giving up. People care. People do care. We just need more people that care and, and more people in power that care, that want to see a change.